Hey guys, it is me, Chef Frankie here, and we're back with another Minecraft tutorial video. In today's video, guys, I'm going to be showing you how to use the function command in Minecraft. Chances are, if you've played Minecraft within the past couple of weeks, and you probably already noticed this command in your own game, but have you ever actually wondered how does this command actually work? Now, let me show you an example of a function command that I actually came up with. It's very simple, and then I'm actually going to show you how you can actually make your own function command in your own game. So let me show you. It's very simple. All you have to do is go in your game chat, and uh, it basically just gives you a set of diamond armor that's all it does so you just type in slash function just like this and then you type in diamond just like that you hit enter and after you do that as you can see it gives you a full set of diamond armor where are the boots where are the boots go did it give me the boots did the boots come up oh i guess oh no i didn't program it to give me boots at all so now i'm going to show you how you can actually make your own function pack for minecraft as you can see i'm actually on an android right now so if you're on android i recommend using a file explorer like es file explorer i'll put it in the link in the description if you want to go ahead and download it if you're on ios then i recommend using this file explorer called documents they both work great basically the same way uh so let's go ahead and open it and uh, I'll actually leave the file that I'm showing you in this video in the description down below as well. So if you want to check it out, it'll be right there. So click on ES File Explorer right over here. It's going to take a while to boot up. Click on Downloads right here. As you can see, I have this template right over here. As you can see, it says Function underscore template by Chef Frankie. You can go ahead and download it in the description down below. This is basically the template that we're going to be using to make our own function pack. And uh, it actually won't take that long, guys. It's very easy to do. So what you want to do is you just want to hold down it. I'm pretty sure it's the same for documents on iOS. Hold it down. After you do that, you want to extract the files just like this. So you want to click extract just like this. And uh, it should extract the files. Hit OK just like that. It's going to extract the files for you. Then you want to go ahead and click on it just like this. And as you can see, I have it all wonderfully set up for you guys. So you don't have to change anything. This folder right over here though you want to click on that right over here guys is the function that i showcased to you in the video so you can actually change this function to whatever function you want it to be and you can also create multiple functions in the same file so actually guys let's do this from scratch so you can actually learn how to do something so here i'm actually just going to delete this uh, right now i'm going to delete it and uh we can actually make ourselves a brand new function all you have to do is just click on new create a file and uh, just name this, uh, what do you want it to be named? Let's name it uh, function, actually, you know what? No, let's not name it function. Let's name it tutorial, just like this. Tutorial, and then we're gonna create it just like that. And you wanna make sure it's an MC function file. So you wanna rename it dot MC, F-U-N-C-T-I-O-N, just like that. MC function, just like that. Hit okay, click on it, just like this. Open it as a text file using ES no editor, just like that. So guys, let's just use the commands to give ourselves a dead bush and a diamond sword as an example. But make sure, guys, when you type in these commands in here, you do not actually use a slash when you type in these. You know when you go in the game chat and you type in a slash all the time? Well, for these, you don't actually use a slash. Otherwise, it will not work at all. I tried it with a slash. It didn't work for any reason. I don't know why it didn't work. So let's do, uh, let's do, uh, what was it? Give at... S and then we're gonna do dead bush just like this and make sure it's actually one full word there's no space or underscore between the words dead and bush it's just one full word i don't know why they did it like that now we're gonna give ourselves a diamond sword so give at s diamond make sure you spell it very accurately diamond underscore sword just like that so after you're done typing in your commands you want to make sure that they're all spelled correctly and there's no slash in front of them you want to go and hit the save button right here it should say that it saved the file at the bottom of your screen now all you have to do guys is select all of these files right here and compress it into a zip file just like this just compress it into a zip file then you want to take this file just like this hold it down and rename it to something else otherwise you're going to have issues because it's going to think it's the other file that you downloaded so you want to put like a two at the end of it hit okay then you want to move this over back to your download just like this so you want to hold it down again move to and then you want to scroll down until you see downloads move it over to your downloads hit okay then in your downloads here it is function template by chef frankie 2 that is it make sure it's the one with the two at the end of it otherwise you're going to get something completely different you want to rename this file to a dot mc pack just like this it's very simple to do all you have to do is just type in mc p-a-c-k just like that and uh guys that's basically all you have to do that's it guys now all you have to do to import it into minecraft is just click on it just like this click on the file and it should start to open up minecraft start loading it up just like this as you can see uh let's wait for it to load come on load up uh it should start to import it 
Oh, uh, where, what happened to it? What happened? Import started. Okay, finally it started. Finally, guys. We did it! Okay, successfully imported function template just like that. So if you did it correctly, guys, that's what it should say. Go ahead and apply it to one of your worlds just like this, whatever world you want it to be. Just go ahead and uh, turn off achievements just like that. So, guys, I finally loaded up my world. Let's see if the command actually works. So we have to type in the command, which is slash function just like this and guys remember the name that you put here is the name of the file of whatever you named the function so for this example we did tutorial so you want to type in tutorial just like that and guys moment of truth let's hit the enter button right over here and see what we get whoa guys we got a dead bush and we got a diamond sword just like that guys it was that easy that's all you had to do and also put a link to the template that was used in this video so you can go ahead and mess around with the function command yourself in your own minecraft world just go ahead and click in the description i'll put it right there and guys if you want to go ahead and see my other tutorial video on how to crash your own minecraft world go ahead and click up on my screen right now that thing right over there take you right to the video click on it and uh it's it's a pretty cool video guys i gotta say pretty cool go ahead check it out anyways guys that is it for today's video thank you all for watching don't forget to like the video subscribe turn on notifications join my discord server follow me on twitter and all that generic youtuber stuff and and and, and trash don't forget to do that i'll see you all in the next minecraft video guys bye Oh no guys, who's that behind me? Officer Earl! Oh no, he's coming to get me! Oh no!